Sports. President Abdel Fattah Sisi on Tuesday met his Hungarian counterpart Janos Eder in the Hungarian capital Budapest during the second day of his official visit to the country. The president has got an official reception at the presidential palace in Budapest. Presidential spokesman Basem Rodi said that President Sisi held face-to-face -face talks with his Hungarian counterpart and were followed by expanded sessions where the president hailed the strong ties between Egypt and Hungary, expressing hope to boost those ties particularly on the economic and investment levels. For his part, the Hungarian president hailed relations with Egypt and noted that Egypt is the most important economic partner in the Middle East. He hailed Egypt's role in, the settling, in settling the escalating tensions in the Palestinian Gaza Strip. The Hungarian leader noted that he and President Sisi had probed means of fostering bilateral economic ties. After their talks, the two presidents held a joint press conference, during which President Sisi hailed the, the Hungarian efforts to develop the Middle East region. President Sisi said that fighting terrorism is crucial to maintaining stability in the region, calling on all the world to unite in combating terrorism. On Ethiopia's dam, the president called for reaching an agreement on filling and operating the dam, noting that Egypt seeks to guarantee its share of the water. He said Egypt has no other source of water than the Nile River, asserting that Egypt necessitates water for development, not for disputes nor conflicts. The Hungarian president, for his part, expressed his country's understanding of Egypt's stance towards the GERD issue, stressing that this case can concrete stability in the whole region. President Yanis Eder has held a banquet on President Sisi's and his accompanying delegation's honour. المتحدث President Abdel Fattah Sisi addressed the Visegrad conference with Egypt in the Hungarian capital Budapest and held a round of talks with his Hungarian counterpart Janos Eder, who hailed his country's ties with Egypt, saying it is considered the biggest partner in the Middle East region. The summit covers a number of issues, mainly Egypt's role in the Middle East region cooperation to counter terrorism and illegal immigration, energy, security, in addition to opportunities to advance trade, investment and tourism relations between the two countries. President Abdel Fattah Sisi stressed on Tuesday that the coronavirus pandemic proves the necessity of international cooperation. Addressing the Visegrad conference with Egypt in the Hungarian capital Budapest, President Sisi said illegal migration is a reflection of lost human rights in the region. The president noted that the state seeks to provide a decent life for over 100 million Egyptians and also seeks support by its international partners. Sisi said there is need to establish deeper dialogues and deliberations over providing support for the peoples of the world. He confirmed that there is no refugee camps in Egypt, but rather refugees live decent lives at equal footing to Egyptian citizens. The head of state said the state seriously seeks to achieve development and progress in all fields. He noted that up to 500 million Egyptian pounds have been allocated to make lives of citizens better in various domains. He asserted that the leadership in Egypt respects its people and is working on their development. Meanwhile, President Sisi held a round of talks with his Hungarian counterpart, Janos Eder, which centered on bilateral ties and regional issues of mutual concern 
including the war on terrorism and illegal immigration. The president's visit also includes talks with the Hungarian Prime Minister Viktor Orban. The conference covers a number of issues, mainly Egypt's role in the Middle East region, cooperation to counter terrorism and illegal immigration, energy, security, in addition to opportunities to advance trade, investment and tourism relations between the two nations. It also tackles means to develop cooperation between Egypt and the European Union. In addition to Hungary, the conference of the group includes the Czech Republic, Poland and Slovakia. Presidential spokesperson Ambassador Bassem Rodi said Egypt's participation in the bloc for the second time reflects its keenness of the two sides to develop distinguished ties and discuss issues of mutual concern. President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi addressed a key UN biodiversity summit in China on Tuesday, during which he stressed that the world is going through a critical phase that necessitates exerting sincere efforts to face the huge challenges which were aggravated by the coronavirus pandemic at a time when dealing with its negative repercussions is still underway. President al-Sisi thanked China for its keenness on holding this round at the conference despite the challenges facing the multi-party action against the COVID-19 repercussions. In his speech, the head of state also tackled the challenges facing the whole world due to the COVID-19 pandemic. 